Today I'm in Denver with the APHA annual convention. I'll be on the stage with three former CDC directors. We'll be talking about the role of public health and CDC in keeping America and the world safe. I'll be reviewing what's happened over the past seven to eight years, where we've made real progress with better information, better action in this country and abroad, better integration between healthcare and public health, and real health impact, reducing the number of smokers, reducing teen pregnancy, making hospitals and healthcare safer, but we have much more to do. We have to rebuild the public health infrastructure in this country, including laboratories, staffing, data systems. We also have to engage with the world to make sure that we're not caught unprepared by the next global health threat. I had the opportunity to serve as director of the CDC from 1993 to 1998, and I would trade nothing for that experience. This is a really critical agency. The people there are well-trained. They really care about the mission. They will go anywhere, anytime to fight diseases and to protect the health of the American people. And the CDC is going to be a critical part of our becoming the healthiest nation in the world. I think CDC is a national treasure uh, and, a, and a global good, but its strengths include its linkages to strong local and state health departments and all the other people who play an important role in public health. So it's, uh, CDC is terrific, but one of the things that make it terrific is its partnerships and its relationships with the whole fabric of public health. CDC is an incredibly powerful force of public health but it's only as strong as its connections to our state and local health partners and the whole diaspora of entities in the NGO and other communities that really get the work done at the local level. Public health is on the front lines and is critically important. In order to remain relevant and effective, we have to adapt. And that's critically important. To do that, we have to get information, we have to act rapidly, and we have to continuously improve our programs so that we can protect people in this country and around the world. Watch this entire session with on-demand video with APHA Live.